Hi guys, Meg Twin here. Been a little while since I uploaded a new video. Well, let's talk about this Polygon City Pack and Polygon Town Pack that was uh, for free from uh, Marketplace from uh, Epic Epic Games. And I created a project. Let's go up here and see where it's at. It is right here. I just called it Low Poly Project and it's using version 4.24 of Unreal. Let me open that up for a minute and I'll show you something here. Okay. I got that and here is the Polygon City Pack with the uh, meshes in it. And I was all excited till I found out that it's actually set up like the rig for the mannequin in the uh, Unreal Starter content so that you could retarget the uh, mannequin's animations and make these guys move like the mannequin moves. But I wanted to do something different. I wanted to have these uh, characters be able to be exported into Mixamo and get some specific animations that I wanted for them. And I thought you might be interested in seeing how to go about doing that. So if you downloaded the Polygon City and the Polygon Town Pack, let's see what kind of meshes we have in here. Alright, let's say... Alright, let's say the character Sun in the... what is it? Polygon Town Pack. I'm going to right click on him and go to Asset Actions here and I'm going to export it and I'm just going to put it on my desktop so I can find it easily hopefully <laughs> so I'll save it out there I'm not going to make any changes in here I'm just going to hit export and then I'm going to minimize Unreal and I'm going to go into my Blender 2.8 program and just general. I'm going to get rid of the cube and I'm going to import that FBX file and let's see, I put it on my desktop right here, the character Sun and I'm just going to import that and click on import FBX and there he is. Just want to hit one to get the front view and the period key to bring them up close. Now I don't want this rig on them. I want Mixamo to rig them for me. So I'm going to select him. I'm going to hit Alt P. I'm going to say clear and keep transformation. Then I'm going to choose the rig. Do the same thing with Alt P. Choose clear and keep transformation. Then I'm going to delete the rig. And then down here, it's going to be a little uh, empty. If you hit the period key, you can zoom in on it. And I'm going to delete that too. Okay. Now, I'm going to hit one to, or the period key to bring him up close. Now all I'm going to do is go over here to the uh, vertex groups. And I'm going to delete all of these. Delete all groups. And what I'll do now is go over here to File. I'm going to Export FBX. And I'm going to... I have my operator presets uh, set up for what I call my FBX export setup. And I'll show you what it's set up to. Um, it's set up to include the armature and the mesh, but in this case I'm only including the mesh, so I'm just going to select that. And check in your geometry panel, make sure the smoothing shows face. I don't need to mess with armatures, I'm not doing that, so I'm not messing with those. We don't have any animation on them. So I just go back to main. And I guess I'll name it... I think I created a folder already in my, I think it was my documents, where is it? Yeah, low poly Mixamo rig. 
that's what I named the folder. I'm just going to put it in there, and I'm going to call it, uh, I'll call it Low Poly Sun. Okay. And then I'm just going to export it. Okay. And I'm going to close Blender, because I don't need it open anymore. And I'm just going to discard any changes to it. I don't need to go back to it. Now I'm going to open up Mixamo. Right there. I'm going to hit Upload Character. And I'm going to find that folder where I exported the boy to. should be in here and here, this low poly sun. Just going to drag it and pop it into Mixamo. Just like that. And there he is. And he looks just fine. So I'm going to hit next. And now I'm going to place where these markers should be so they know how to rig him up. Put the wrist on the wrist. Right about there. Elbows go here. The knees, you can tell, are right here. And the groin, you can tell, is right there. So get that set up. And I'm going to leave it at standard skeleton because even though they're low poly, they still have uh, five fingers. And I'm just going to hit next, and it's going to rig them up for us. Might take a few seconds. or maybe longer. <laughs> there we go. Let's see if he looks right. Yep, he looks just fine. Good. I'm going to hit next. And he's in the T-pose, and I'm going to go ahead and download him in the T-pose. Just hit download and leave everything the way it is and hit download. And select where you want to put him. And I'm going to put him in that folder that I made called Low Poly Mixamo Rig. Except I'm going to create a new folder. And I'll just name this Sun. And I'm going to put him, save him to that. Then I'm going to go to Animations for this. And I'm just going to search for an idle animation. And let's see here he's not fighting he's just pretty much standing around so let's do this that looks good so I'm just gonna download that but this time I'm gonna download it without the skin and that's all I need to do hit download Now it wants to know where I want to put it. I want to go ahead and put it in this Sun folder, but I want to create another one called Anims, or Animations. And I'm going to put Idle in there. And let's get a Walk animation. Just get a normal walk for him. You don't have a shopping bag, so we don't need that one. Get rid of that. Uh. I don't want him walking like a girl, because he's a dude. Okay, how about... Just walking. Let's do that. Walk with a little bit of a swagger. Here he goes. Alright, and make sure you click in place. Otherwise, you'll have issues with it later on. And I'm going to download it also without the skin. Download. And it's going to be named Walking. I'm going to go ahead and put that in the same folder. Now we want a... How about a jump? want a jump one. Let's see if we can find the regular jump. Where are we? Come on. There you go, this one here. And that's going to be in place. OK, 
Okay, that's, yeah, we want that one. So let's download that one without the skin. Again, download. And I'm going to put that in the same folder as the rest of them. And let's download a running for him. We'll just get basic. Uh, let's see. Try this running here and click in place. looks pretty good. Well, let's check the knee height. Let's make it come up a little higher. There we go. It looks like he's making a little bit of more of an effort here. I'm going to increase the speed a little bit there. Okay, and we'll check his arm space. Arm space is good. Alright, so we're just going to click on download and we'll download him without the skin again. I'm going to put him in that same folder. So we have four simple animations for him right now. So that's all we need for him for now. I'm going to go ahead and leave him in Mixamo in case I want to come back and get more animations because when I come back to Mixamo he'll still be here. Um, unless you leave Mixamo for a really long time and come back then for some reason it replaces your whatever you had in there with something else and in that case you'll have to reload him again so let's get out of that and open up Unreal and so I don't get them confused with everybody else I'm gonna go to the content folder create a new folder I'm gonna call that modded cares for modded characters Alright, and click inside here. I'm going to make a new folder called Boy. I'll open that. Now I'm going to go here and... Okay, this one that we put inside the folder is the one that uh, we have a rig on, right? <laughs> yeah, that's only 149. Yeah, I put him in here. Okay, so here's a low poly sun. I'm just going to drag and drop him in the box. Close that so we can see what's going on here. I don't want to make any changes at all. Um, I'm not going to create new materials because he already has materials. So I just say do not create. And leave everything the way it is. And just hit import. And there's our guy. That's our low poly sun. Let's just hit save save selected and then I'm gonna open that folder again actually let's go back in here let's right click and make a new folder in here called anims alright and now I've opened that I'm gonna open this one and I'm going to select all of these and I'm gonna drag them all into there and make sure animation length is set to animation animated time and the only other thing you need to look at is the skeleton up here because we've already created one for it when we first dropped him in and it's called this low poly sun skeleton now if you named your file something different obviously it's going to have that file name here for the skeleton so choose that one so I'll choose that one and since we have four animations we're just going to hit import all otherwise you'll have to keep hitting import for each animation so we just want to put them all in there and there they are let's check out the idle that looks good <laughs> okay I'll just save that one let's check out the walk oh yeah that looks good. Got him walking around. Okay. And running. There we got him running. That's good. And we have a jump for him. That's good. Alright, cool. 
So that's how you can get those low poly characters into Mixamo. Um, I did try to just take, let's see, which one was it? When I tested this out first, I think I took her, I took the female police in, into uh, Mixamo just like she was with the rig she already had and put um, a walk animation on it. But when I brought it back into Mixamo and selected the only skeleton that they had in here, it just didn't work out right. Her arms were all weird. <laughs> so I, and I want other animations for them. And I don't, you know, they're not all going to use the same animations, I don't think. But that's one way to uh, take these low poly characters into uh, Blender and then get them into Mixamo and give them some simple animations and then just plop them right back into uh, Unreal. Um, probably end up doing a couple more characters, but in my next video I'll probably show you how to uh, give our son character some animation, be able to put him in here and, and uh, use him as a player. So uh, that'll be in the next video. So thanks a lot for watching. Hope you enjoyed it, and I uh, hope you'd like to see more of this. If you do, let me know so I can continue on. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.